Welcome and thank you for attending ALHS First Cross Country Meet. But first, let's introduce our three-year varsity athlete, Nora Preston. Nora Preston has a lot going on, at, like maintaining a job, schoolwork, and of course, sports. Today, we'll be talking about her family and friends, hobbies and interests, and future plans. Let's run off and start off with her family and friends. Nora's family co consists of a small household, which contains her mother, Jordan, father, Matthew, sister, Emma, and Nora being the youngest. Emma works, Emma works and lives in Washington, DC, where she is in a legislative assistant for one of the congressmen. This is one of the reasons why Nora looks up to her sister so much. But let's not forget about her furry animals, Finn, radish, cow, and tuna. Nora has some very interesting stories with some of her pets, like stealing her pet rat, radish from the pet store, and buying her pet bunny, cow, at Craigslist at 10 at night. Nora has two close friends, Jacqueline and Reagan. If you were to ask them, a few, uh, if you were to ask them what words describe Nora the best, they would say she's sincere, thoughtful, hardworking, and can be the last one. Now moving on, as we're furnishing the first quarter of the mile, we're as we're furnishing the first quarter of the mile, we're going to move on to the second quarter of the mile, which consists of her hobbies and interests. Working for three, for, working at a family business for three years, Krispy Kreme, Nora may not get to choose where she gets to work, but she sure does enjoy working there. Nora is also part of the cross country team at school. As she describes herself as not being too fast, she can always go cool down at the public library where she actually volunteers there. This has become like a second home to her and the employees feel like family to her. Nora also likes to spend time with her friends they like to go to the gym and study together. Nora likes to also go shopping, although she may not have money. When you can't find Nora shopping, hanging out with friends, or volunteering, you can always find her reading books or watching one of her favorite shows, Criminal Minds. Nora also loves to read English Murder Mysteries by Robin Stevens. As we are getting closer to the finish line, we are going to go over her future plans. Nora doesn't know what she wants to do right now. All we do know is that she doesn't want to move to Washington, D.C. and live in a small studio small studio apartment. She would, she would like to be the head of a national library and get her degree in science library. She would also like to go get coffee with her sister and walk their dogs. Although Nora says she does not want to be poor forever, all we know is that in 10 years, Nora wants to be able to be rich, and she would like to cross the bridge and become married and have kids. As Nora sprints to the, to the finish line, Nora gets first place. Today, we went um, over her friends and family, hobbies and interests, and future plans. Although Nora doesn't know what she would like to do, we can all we can say is that she has a bright path ahead of her, and we can only hope for the best for her because she, let's hope she doesn't end up poor. Thank you.